So Mr. Franklin, I have a question about products liability. I've been sure. building custom bikes from the ground up now for some time, and I want to know what I need to do to protect myself. You talk about protecting yourself from possibly being sued? Yes. All right, first of all, products liability is, is this. You're the manufacturer, or possibly somebody in the distribution chain of that product. You might be somebody, like a vendor, and you, you as the manufacturer, let's say, putting together all the pieces to make this full-size motorcycle, the first thing you need to do is one, you need to incorporate to protect your personal assets. Second thing is you go out and buy the best insurance you possibly can. And that insurance will cover the actual product that you're developing in case somebody goes down the road, they lose a part, in this case, motorcycle frame breaks, and they crash and they hurt themselves or worse, they die. And if you don't have that kind of protection relative to liability, then you're gonna have a problem. Somebody's gonna sue your company, they're gonna bankrupt you, um, they're going to try to reach you personally if you have assets, if they can possibly pierce the corporate veil and get around the corporation to go at you personally. But insurance is the first step. And it, I, since it's a motor vehicle, it actually might be fairly expensive. The second thing is that you require of all your vendors, the, the ones that are producing the parts to put on your motorcycle, that they have, I would suggest at least two to five million dollars worth of liability insurance for their parts in case they fail. Because, God forbid, the person that buys your motorcycle ends up paralyzed. The damages can be just incredible. You, you have no idea how, how high they can be. So you having, let's say, a five million dollar liability policy may not be enough. So if you're dealing with company XYZ and they're making foot pegs for your bike, you want to make sure that they're fully insured in case they have uh, an issue with the foot pegs, let's say they break off and the person falls or something, that they can go after them as well. Also, I would construct an agreement with all your vendors that they would indemnify you in case you get sued, that they would step in if it's their faulty product that caused, causes the defective motorcycle or product that you build ultimately that fails. Does that make sense? Yes, thank you. You're welcome. This posted video is in no way specific legal advice on any subject. It is intended to provide general information for the public. If you need specific legal advice, call Chuck at 480-545-0700.